All right, we've got our nearly finished product here. We did a couple bends to the circuit. You can see the first thing we added were some buttons. Um, those exploit our glitch bend with feedback that we found before, so. Each button corresponds to one of the three original buttons. Except now instead of going to ground, they go to the uh, speaker output to create feedback loop. All right, uh, from here to here, for instance. And uh, all right. Second thing was we added some controls for finer uh, granularity on the pitch by connecting. Uh, you can see on the underside of the circuit, you've got a resistor and a capacitor. These two control uh, the timing of the chip. They basically create uh, a small timing circuit. So by changing the value of that resistor with a potentiometer or two body contacts, you can control the speed. So for instance, right now we have the switch set to uh, the potentiometer here, so. You can see you can get a lot of interesting tempo changes there. And in the other mode, we've got body contacts. <laughs> Which creates a lot of fun. <laughs> As you can see. All right, and uh, the last thing we're going to add is a uh, mini headphone out, as you can see here. That's just going to um, span the two audio outputs here, and that'll be it. That way we can record it or amplify it directly.